Yeah, I can hold. Hey, how are you? Good. Yeah, man. Are you, you no kidding? No kidding. Oh, I gotta go. I'll talk to you later. All right. Bye bye. Sorry for that little interruption, kids. I'm Mr. Langford, and this is a video on why at the end of a word, why at the end of the word, it's got to be a two syllable word, and that why makes the long e sound. One more time. Why at the end of a word, of a two-syllable word, and that Y makes a long E sound. Let me give you an example. Everybody, puppy, aw, puppy, pup. That's E, long E sound. That looks like pup pie, pup pie, pup pie. No, it's pup E. That's the sound it makes. How about this one? Sil Lee, Sil E, silly, not sill I, not sill I, silly. Interesting, huh? How about this one? Here's a, it's a word you see quite a bit. How do you say this one, kids? Two syllables. It's got the Y at the end. This is many. It's not man Y. Many. Common word. Here's a really common word. It's not ver y, it's ver e, very. You know that word, very? Very. Yeah, that y at the end of a two-syllable word makes the long e sound. Ver e, not ver y, ver e. Look for it. Here's another one. This is not bab i, bab y, bay b. That Y makes the E sound. Babe, E. Baby. Baby. Everybody used to be a baby. Last one. How do you say that? Luck Y? Luck E. Lucky. I'm a lucky guy. All right. So quickly, this has been a short video on why at the end of a word, specifically of a two-syllable word, and it makes the long E sound. Okay? I'm Mr. Langford. I will see you next time.